ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West, um, part three. I'm trying to get to this bloody lift. take him out if he walks past. Come on. You little shit, how did he see me? What just saw me? Nothing. Excuse me. Why am I in here? Oh my god. Again. Okay, the creaking doesn't sound good. I have to detach those cables quick. Got no idea where I'm supposed to go.
Where? Don't make any sense. Over this way. This should be the right spot. Oh, there. That connector is holding the cables together. It should break if I shoot it. Shoot it. Uh oh that. Don't fall. Oops. Dead. Target it first. Oh, what? Oh my god. Hit the acid thing.
no ammo. Oh, what? Now, what a fight. No, how about again? <sighs> I need to take this thing down to get to the data center. I should scan for weak spots. Okay, where's that weak spot? That sack's full of that. We should target it first. Watch out for that acid. Careful kind of station too. Shit. 
Oi. Is it dead? Jesus dead. Christ. Finally. What a fight. The data center should be straight ahead. I guess Farrell's gonna have to find another way there. Connect all this, used up loads of health doing that. That thing was a beast. Please be here. Okay. Could that be the end of the tutorial? It's here. Goddess. 
There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Got it. For all... I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world. Things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone. Varl, I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <sighs> okay, I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. So, back to Meridian, Actually, then... Uh, I've got a better idea. On to New Worlds. Forbidden West. urgent matter to discuss. Dashaean, that makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. What's this? Watch your step. You saved us all, to be sure, but... Uh... We're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. Statue of Aloy. One night, for less than half a minute, glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that, we left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The spire is supposed to send out signals, messages for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know what you find. 
Yeah, what happened here? Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Oh my god, what? Up there? Uh. Uh, maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. Caster can't reach that from here. I need to get closer. There we go. Now, how to cross over to the spire. Should be able to get up there now. Was helping me when he gave me Look at this head. detail on this machinery. Looks like Incredible. It transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? We've certainly sent the set it? the be benchmark for our I future releases. I can track him down. Hopefully, the transmission note at the top will tell me. Um. Well, it doesn't look like I can keep climbing this way. <laughs> Looks like this panel's ajar. Can I go up through the inside? Controllers rattling with the heptic feedbacks. <laughs> Engaging maintenance configuration. <clears throat> Wonder what the carja will make of this. Oh, look at the rain effects. <laughs> Stop rattling, Jesus. Finally figured it out. 
To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You read the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You are the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't take one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, then why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? I will go find you, Robert. Yes. Well, the coordinates make it simple enough. Even for you. So, out to the Forbidden West. Look at the rain effects. Wow. went inside it and it transformed almost like the day of the battle I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day few have seen the tower change from Meridian what did you discover? Hades the danger didn't end here it went into the Forbidden West and I have to follow I see that can be difficult the West is called Forbidden for a reason a tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. It's an act. They oh. allow no trespassers past the Factions. Let's see. Under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated. And indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage. Is that right for you? And attacking on sight. Great. Just what I need. More killers. Uh, the Sun King. Oh Aloy, look at this goon. It's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a minute. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. Uh, Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit. Vinasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. What's this? Weapons? We must you. Yeah, I'll have that. Anna. <laughs> Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. you'd like to spend more time with your friends come speak to me when you're ready to depart so tutorial was officially over now can I spend any money I need to
to attach the master override to my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. Machine carcasses. Remnants from the Battle of the Alight. So what does it want me to do? Okay. Master override installed. Plus, something new to store up and release energy. Uh, resonator. Uthid, Fanasha, thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it, even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. Fanasha, stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment, but I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to, and it isn't in Meridian. You know, I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had- No, Huntress, please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. It's been months since I was in Sunfall. What's become of the Shadow Karja? <laughs> After you wiped out the Eclipse, there were hardly any priests or officers left to terrorize the little people. Abad offered amnesty to all who were forced to serve the Shadow. So the commoners cleaned out the citadel and handed it back to him. The Sundom was unified. Avad wanted Uther to take command of the garrison there. So well done so far. Here refused. Rumor has it that he wanted to stay close to me here in Meridian. <laughs> That's nonsense, of course. <laughs> You both look like you're doing well. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. That means people actually have to listen to him talk? May the sun bless their sorry souls. At least I say something of substance every once in a while. What was that? <laughs> I just fell asleep while you were talking. And how about you, Vanasha? I've been looking after Nasadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part. Bad influence. Huh. I was going to say Nanny, but I like your version better. Well, I, I know. I know. They're out. Go! Away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Is there a shop around there or anything? It's part of the Deathbringer we defeated. Oh. This machine was the last line of defense for Hades. It dragged the orb up here and then nearly killed me, but it's just a piece of scrap now. Why can't I examine my... Oh, I can. I guess I should be flattered by the <laughs> statue. It feels wrong. Especially when my job's only half done. It looks like a memorial. Honoring those who fell in the Battle of the Alight. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. We were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. 
Will we push through? So, who else we got? This guy. This woman. Dowager Queen Masadi. Blessed champion. Itaman, what do you say? My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall and for defending our holy city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? You said it fine, Edmund. And you're welcome. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? It's a man. I, uh... I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. But when I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. We owe you our lives, champion. And we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out for Thunderjaws, champion! Okay. I've got any other friends here, have I? The sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold and jewels. But I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. You were right. I'm sorry, Avad. What's wrong with It's good to see you, but I <laughs> can't stay home. I see. I had hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. At the palace. Meridian's still in danger. But it's bigger than that. To put things right, I have to go west. To Noct territory. By the sun, that's a Noct? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but after years of hostility, we've negotiated a truce in hopes of a lasting peace. Another embassy will be held in just a day or two. When you say, years of hostility, I assume you mean the Red Raids? Ah, uh, yes. My favorite subject. I wouldn't ask if I didn't need to know. As you know, my father raided all the border tribes. Asaram, Banuk, and Nora suffered greatly, resisting as best they could. But none fought back like the Tanakh. They rose up and assaulted our western front at Barren Light, sweeping us from their lands. Getting them to talk to us again after that was tricky. What makes this coming embassy so special? Not just like today, it is special because of the guest. Our delegation will meet with the Tanakh just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. Fashav, one of our finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean raider? No. Not in this case. Fashav is my cousin. Nothing like Helis and his ilk. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. And has been held ever since. Your cousin, Fashav. How long has he been a Tanakh captive? Five years. Tanakh emissaries swear he is well, but I wonder. That tribe is renowned for its brutality. How did he survive? Well, I'll know soon enough. 
If you see him before I do, tell him that I await him in Meridian, where he belongs. If I see him, I will. Right, that's enough of that. I need Let's to go. One moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. The way you left before, there's no way to know when I'll see you again. I'm not trying to stop you. Or hold you back. But I need to know. When your mission is over, will you return to Meridian? And stay? But long enough for us to spend time to get to know each other properly, perhaps. Are you kidding? The guy's a bit of a goon. Um... Avad, the, the situation calls for a, a higher perspective. The threat I'm facing endangers not just Meridian, but a lot of other places too. A lot of innocent people. What happens between us, it's not important. At least, not yet. You're right. I'm acting like a fool. It's supposed to be the king who calls for a higher perspective. Please accept my apology. And my wishes for your success. Goodbye, Aloy. No chance. As always, <laughs> our hopes ride with you. So that's everyone. Are you ready to go? Well, that's or do you need a little more time? I guess it was nice to catch up. It's time to go. I better get going. Let's start this journey. And if I'm headed west, it sounds like I'll need light of passage from the Tanakh, as you said. Where exactly is this embassy going to be held? Past the Daunt, the canyon that marks the western border of the Sundom. You'll find the fortress of Baron Light at its farthest edge. The embassy will take place just beyond its gates. It's a long march, a fortnight on foot. A couple of days hard riding should get us there. Actually, it might be better to rest here tonight. Head out in the morning. Of course. I'll arrange it. Oh, look at that stonework. She's going without him. So it begins.
tunic. the end <laughs> no it's just started so three hours in and the game has just started I mean, usually, but not today. Uh, not yet. And why is that? Well, the Daunt. The whole valley. It's infested with machines. I can handle machines. Oh, I'm sure you can, but uh, I'm under strict orders not to operate until the whistle down at Chain Scrape sounds the all clear. Look, I didn't come all this way just to stand around and wait. I'll crank that car down myself if I have to. Well, but then... Who would crank it back up? <laughs> fine, fine. Though, should anyone ask, it might be best to say you forced me. I see smoke, but not a lot of activity. Smoke's probably coming. Level from three, I'm points to spend. As for the quiet, well, there's a work stoppage in effect because of all the fuss. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? Nasty ones, and lots of them. Bristlebacks, they're called. The strangeness is, they're not native to the dot. Just showed up. All of a sudden. No hunters to kill them? Well, we've got hunters, just none that want to cross all the boss of chain scrape. He is self-appointed. Work stoppage was his idea. Yeah, well, I'm just passing through. Got an embassy to attend. You should have said that ain't gonna happen no time soon. It's just perfection at the moment. What are you talking about? Graphics, playability, story. Hear that? That's your answer. Who is that? Karja Sun Priest. Cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light, he's the one supposed to run it. <sighs> Great. You don't do as I say immediately. The Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you, I was forced to spend the night shivering in the tent. Exposed to attack, I might have died. Oh, me you refuse to transport, but not this... This... What? This Nora girl? This savage? Besides Scallywag? Wadis. That's Aloy. Studious Wadis. Aloy? You know, savior of Meridian? Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. 
I came here for the Embassy of Baron Light. The way I hear it, so did you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the Sun Priest's most precious. Right. That's the end of uh, today's session, everyone. The game starts here, three hours in, and um, finally into the main meat of the game. So uh, thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.